Hey what's up Robert here coming at you with another Photoshop tutorial this time showing you how to create a 3D anaglyph effect here in Photoshop just using one image. So here's what the final outcome should look like. You can tell that the hand looks 3D. So normally when you create 3D images you would take a picture from one angle then move the camera over and take a picture from the other angle. Same with video usually the video camera has two lenses and takes two different videos to make it 3D. Now here we're only going to be using one image. So I'm going to go ahead and open up the image that I have here and I'm going to double click this background layer rename it I don't know 3D click OK and now we have our 3D layer. Next thing I want to do is click and drag it down to the new layer icon to create a 3D copy and now we can get started. So we're basically trying to make it look as if we took this picture from two different angles and one way we can do that is with the perspective transform tool. So all we got to do is go to edit transform perspective go over here to the topmost left node drag this up and you can pay attention to this height here right now it's at 107 and I think that's okay just remember that it's 107 you don't have to remember the 0.08 or anything once that's done hit enter and now go to the next layer edit transform perspective or you can hit control T right click perspective and now let's do the same to the right top node and bring this up to around 107 doesn't have to be exactly the same then hit enter now what that did was it pretty much made this photo look like it was taken from two different angles as you can see there. So now all we have left to do is to double click our 3D copy layer to bring up the layer styles. Come over here to the red channels, uncheck red, click OK. And now you have the red and blue 3D looking effect. You can hold down shift and hit the left arrow key a couple times to get the effect you're looking to create. Uh, right there is OK. And then you have a little bit of an overlap over here, which can be taken care of with the crop tool. So there you have it, creating a 3D effect to a single image in Photoshop. You can follow me on Twitter at Robs Productions. Visit the site robertsproductions.net. Like me on Facebook.com slash Roberts Productions. And even subscribe to this channel for weekly tutorials just like this one. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below along with requests. You can also leave a comment below. Hope this helped. Thank you for watching and until next time, take care. That was a dramatic intro.